Welcome back. I know it's been a while, but I got something special for today. I got the Pokemon 25th Anniversary Celebration set that just released this past Friday. So I got some booster packs from a couple of the products I was able to get my hands on. So let's go ahead and open these up and see what the set has for the 25th anniversary of Pokemon. As you can see right here, these packs are a little different than typical booster packs. Uh, these booster packs have four cards. In this set, Pokemon has put in a bunch of cards from the past and also made uh, interesting modifications and combinations uh, with cards in the past with newer Pokemon. So even though that there are only four cards in this booster pack, we're probably going to pull some really good stuff. Uh, I have looked in this set and there are a ton of really, really cool cards in this set. It's a really small set. So hopefully I'll be able to complete the set and see some of the cards that uh, a lot of people were chasing when I was growing up as a kid and when I missed out on Pokemon. So uh, let's go ahead and open this booster pack up and see what we could uh, what we could get from here. So, so I want to be extra careful opening these uh, these packs up because there's only four cards in it. So I don't want to damage any of these cards. But everything that we're gonna find in in this is uh, should be pretty good. So our first card, as you can see, is a Palkia. And it seems to be holographic. I think a majority of these cards are holographic. Um, so Palkia is the space water dragon Pokemon. Every card in this set has the uh, 25th anniversary logo. So like I said, even though we only have four cards in the pack, we're always gonna get some really good stuff. So here's our first card, Palkia. And look at that, we got Dialga which is the, what is it, the um, the time Pokemon. So this Palkia is the space Pokemon, my bad. Dialga is the steel dragon um, time Pokemon. Also really cool. Um, the new uh, diamond, or is it diamond and pearl? Yeah, the new diamond and pearl remake game. It's gonna be coming out really soon. So it's really interesting that these two are the first uh, first cards that I pull from the set because these are the two legendary Pokemon uh, from that game. And by the way, I will be getting that game. I've never played the original version, so it's gonna be really cool to play a new Pokemon game. Then our third card is, whoa, look at that. I remember this card growing up. I never had it, but it's Team Rocket Zapdos. Oh man, this is a really, old school card as you can see from the bottom 1995 96 99 98 wow so cool looking so this is one of the retro cards um in this set then our last card is hey professor's research okay yeah so here's a a staple card in the game where you discard your hand and draw seven cards uh, pretty much every deck has this card but of course this is Professor Oak, the original professor from the game and the TV show. And what's really cool about this card is you could see his arm is coming out of the box. And he's taking notes onto the card itself. That's pretty unique. And, you know, this is one card from this set that, you know, is uh, very cool, very unique. And the rest of the cards, they do something very special like that so this is why this set is so awesome so i'm gonna put these aside uh, plan on sleeving these cards up later because all these cards are hits i think these are these are pulls people wouldn't say that some of these are pulls but hey a holographic card to me this is a pull so that hit that we got in that pack is the Rocket Zapdos. Oh, and let me show you guys. I don't know if I'll be able to capture this on the camera, but you can kind of see it's, there's some texture to the card. You know, the holographic um, portion of the card is in this box, but if you could see, like the texture is all around 
and even the Team Rockets uh, member, uh, there's some texture on it. So, yeah, these cards are really, really cool. I like them quite a bit. And there are a couple of cards that I'm looking to chase but because the set is so small. Hopefully, I'm able to find them. Um, as you notice, there's really no card trick to opening these packs, so you just open them away. Oh, here we go. Here's a really cool card. Groudon. So there are um, Team Magma members uh, in the background of this card. I love these Pokemon cards uh, that have additional Pokemon in the background and the artwork, or they have like trainers or characters or gym members uh, in the back. I think that's really cool than having just the Pokemon. So we got a Groudon. Oh, there we go. So one of my favorite Pokemon games is Pokemon Gold and Silver. And Ho-Ho is one of the legendary Pokemon that was in uh, Pokemon Gold. So this is really cool to me. Uh, I'm personally a big fan of Lugia, but Ho-Ho is also really awesome. So yeah, this is also a holographic card. Really, really cool looking artwork. And look at that. Man, it's something about the these packs, but I think they have like a set of uh, like the, the duos. Like we had Palkia and Dialga in the first pack. And this one we got Ho and Lugia. Man, yeah, I, I love Lugia. Lugia was definitely my favorite from the second generation. And then our last card is, whoa, look at that. If you guys did not know, back in the day, they had a card called Flying Pikachu, where Pikachu was attached to a bunch of balloons. So this is something unique that they're doing in this set. They took an old idea, an old card from way back in the day, and they're mixing it up with uh, the cards, uh, modern day cards, like the V cards and the V Max cards. So if you guys didn't know, the Pokemon V cards are kind of like a, a really powerful, strong Pokemon card. Uh, but the next card up is a VMAX where the Pokemon becomes gigantic. So we have a gigantic Pikachu. I don't know how many balloons are attached to him, but <laughs> enough to have him up in the sky and <laughs> you can see how big he is. He's bigger than the plane that's flying by. Oh man, this card is so beautiful. <sighs> Fantastic card then in the back oh i forgot to take the card cold card away but look at that two really really good hits already we're just getting started oh gosh the card looks so cool i personally never had the uh flying pikachu back in the day so it's real cool really really cool uh really cool set i love the nostalgia so here we go. This is another legendary Pokemon, Zekrom. I'm not too familiar with Zekrom. I think this is Pokemon Black and White, and I hadn't played uh, in this generation. But I know Zekrom's a pretty cool, uh, cool Pokemon. Zekrom? Oh, Cosma. There we go. Again, another Pokemon I'm not very familiar with. I didn't play the game during this time. I only played Sword and Shield. Um, Pokemon red and blue and gold and silver. So the first two generations, I'm very, very familiar with. That's what I grew up playing and when I had some cards. And our third card is Xerneas. There we go. Oh, man, look at the color on this. And then we got another professor's research. So we did not get a hit on here, but hey, you know what? These are not bad cards. And if you guys are interested in getting this set, uh, they should be available everywhere. The shelves were kind of cleaned out because it was release day, but hey, let me tell you, they're going to be available. So if you have kids, if you want to get into Pokemon cards, I would highly, highly recommend you get this set. Um, there's a bunch of different products, and as you could see, you feel really good opening these packs because usually you don't always get a holographic card in a normal pack. Uh, you kind of have to get lucky and get a hit. 
but these these packs um, you get a hit you get a holographic card and they don't sell these packs standalone you have to buy the products and there's so many different products very very cool products so go ahead and check it out um, and if you can find it in stores go ahead and get it I guarantee you you will have a great time opening these packs uh, kind of reminds me of Shining Fates but I think this is better than Shining Fates so if you were a kid and you played Pokemon growing up get these and you'll definitely feel the nostalgia like I'm feeling right now so we got a Groud on again we got another Ho-Oh is it a Lugia? oh we do have another Lugia so are these packs kind of pre-arranged -pre oh there we go we got a Zama Zenta V so this is an alternate uh, I think Zamazenta, or it's a completely different Zamazenta than the one I'm used to in the normal set. So this is the legendary shield Pokemon from the most recent Sword and Shield game. So really cool hit that we got here. And let's go on to the next one. Yeah, really, there's a lot of really, really cool cards in here. Um... There is some really good throwbacks when I was a kid, cards that people were chasing. So hopefully I could get them because I've never gotten those cards back when I was there. So we have Cosmomium. Then we got a Dialga. There we go, we got a Kyogre. Man. This is the water legendary Pokemon. I love that they have team aqua members here as well really cool looking card and then our last card we got oh we got Mew <clears throat> man this Mew looks really really cool this might not be a hit but I'm gonna count it as a hit because this is the legendary mythical Pokemon in the first generation uh, I remember going to the first Pokemon movie and seeing Mew and Mewtwo this is the first time we've ever seen the mythical Pokemon, so brings back memories for me. So I'm gonna consider that as a hit. There is a gold Mew in this set, so hopefully I could get that. <clears throat> so we got a Xerneas, Groudon, Palkia, and in the back we got another's another professor's research. So the good thing is these packs kind of go a little quick quickly. Uh, I'm taking some time to kind of explain some of these cards. So, here we go. We got Yveltal, another legendary Pokemon. The legendary Pokemon from X and Y. So this is the Y Pokemon, as you can see from the name Yveltal. Really cool artwork. Palkia again. We are getting all the Palkias. Whoa, here we go. We got Cleffa. So this is the baby Pokemon of Clefairy. Wow. Wow, so this is a really interesting card. Um, as you can see the attack, eek, shuffle your hand into your deck, then draw seven cards. So I'm sure this was a card that was used in the game that was very important to get you new cards. Uh, what Pokemon has done is they include cards from the past, the trading card game, that were very useful. Uh, to players who were playing this game. So I imagine this is a throwback to one of those cards. But this is a really, really, really cool card. As you can see, it's textured as well. Awesome, awesome hit. Also from the second generation of Pokemon. Then in the back, we have a uh, Lunala. Awesome, awesome, awesome hit. Let's go. I don't know if I'm gonna have enough room if I continue to get hits like this. But we have filled out the top portion of the camera. So here we go, we got Groudon, Osmog again, Yveltal in the back, we got another Zamazenta V. So I'm gonna put this one right on top of the one we had before. And let's go on to the next pack. Um, I'll tell you what, there are a lot of cool products that they've released for this. Um, let me think. There's one where they have uh, a mosaic of a bunch of Pikachus. 
and there's I don't know how many Pikachu's are in it, but there's four cards and you put the four cards together and they make a really cool artwork. Um, you guys got to go check it out. I'm a big Pikachu fan. I'm looking to hunt for that product. So we got Cosmog. We got another Lugia, another Yveltal, and we got another Professor's Research. All right. Uh, but yeah, there's really, really cool products there. Um, the products that I got were the mini tins that showed the uh, starter Pokemon from the first to the most recent game. And each tin had two of these packs and they had a card of the um, starter Pokemon. And the starter Pokemon, if you collect all eight, they form a giant picture. So we got Dialga, Palkia, Oh, Oh, Oh. Oh, Salago, there we go. This is the uh, Sun Pokemon. Pokemon Sun and Moon. Really cool card. They have Lily, the trainer, in the background. So let's keep on going. Let's see if we could get uh, a classic. Looking for classic uh, Pokemon. There we go. We got another Groudon. Here we go, Kyogre. Osmog, and in the back we have Lunala. We are getting these holographics, but I want to see something from when I was a kid. I want to see a specific fire Pokemon. If you get my hint. A specific fire dragon lizard Pokemon. So we have Kyogre. Oh. Zekrom, and in the back we have Professor's Research yet again. <clears throat> yeah, you know what I'm talking about. They also have uh, the Water and Fire Pokemon, or Water and Grass Pokemon as well. If you catch my drift, Dialga, Palkia, another Lunala. Oh man. Got some packs left, still got some packs. Plenty of time to get some pulls. And if you guys can't find this product in stores, don't worry. This is the 25th anniversary set. Pokemon is gonna be printing a lot of these. Dialga, Palkia. There we go, we got another Cliffa in the back. And we got another Mew, okay. I'll take it. I wonder if these packs are kind of pre-arranged with specific cards in them. I don't know. Ho oh, oh, oh. Zekrom, Cosmog. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, if you guys don't know, this Pikachu uh, is the original Pikachu from the set that I grew up with. And what they did was they took the artwork in the old and they uh they gave it a twist they gave it a, a full art um full art rendition so wow this is exactly how the pikachu looked like when i was a kid such a cool card and as you could see there's a caterpie up at the top and is this i don't know if this is texturized i don't think it is wow really cool card Centering could be better. It's a, a lot of, a lot more to the right, but hey, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna complain. Pikachu is one of my favorite Pokemon. And man, that is a throwback. Wow, that's a great hit. It's a big throwback to, to back in the day when I was a young kid. So we got Kyogre and Cosmog. Cos Cosmium, I think. There we go. And this is another card from back in the day. It was Surfing Pikachu. So we had Flying Pikachu with a, the balloons attached on them. Then we had a Pikachu who was surfing on a surfboard, catching some waves. So unfortunately, we do not have the VMAX. Hopefully, I could get it. But this is a twist that they did with a old card and made it Surfing Pikachu V. Look at all these Pikachus. I like it, I like it, I like it. I'm a big Pikachu fan. 
course, one of my favorite Pokemon growing up. Really, really want that Pikachu uh, mosaic artwork. There we go. So we got Zekrom. Ho oh, oh. There we go. We got another Rocket Zapdos. And we got Lunala in the back. You know, for how small this set is, I guess, and how many different cards, I wouldn't imagine me getting a lot of duplicates, but I'm getting it. Not complaining, though. Not complaining. These are good cards, though. I'm looking for the big chase card. The card that everybody chases. Cosmog. Zekrom. Oh, here we go. So, we had um, Groudon was the old card, but this is Teed Magma's Groudon. Whoa. This is, this is, this must have been some special card back in the day. Um, it's fully texturized. Wow. Card looks fantastic. Oh, man. Really, really cool pool. And we got another surfing Pikachu. Let's go. What a good pack. All right, I think we have seven packs left. So let's see what I could get. Oh man, getting some good pulls. Getting some really good pulls still. You're always gonna have a good time with this set. We got Lugia, Xerneas. Oh my gosh. Look at this, this is, I remember this card. So back in the day, they had dark Pokemon, which was Team Rocket's Pokemon. And I specifically remember this dark Gyarados. Wow, look at the texture on this thing. Wow, the artwork looks great, by the way. Man, what a hit. And in the back, we got another chubby, chubby Pikachu. Back in the day, Pikachu was very chunky. He did not look like the Pikachu we see nowadays. He slimmed up. Man, he, he did not miss any meals. Let's just say that. Oh, man, some great, great pulls. All right, here we go. We got Zekrom, Oh, oh. Kyogre, and another Professor's Research. We're down to our last four, but we are getting some good hits. I'm loving these uh, classic cards that I've seen growing up. And I love the, the artwork and the way that they have it texturized. It's real, real cool. All right, here we go. We got Reshiram, Osmo. Oh my gosh. This is another card from back in the day. This is called Blank's Pikachu. They pretty much refer to this Pikachu as birthday Pikachu because you would write the person's name and be their Pikachu, and you would give this card to them as a gift. And oh my gosh, this card looks amazing. I never got this card. I don't remember how you got it, but oh man, there's some stuff on the card that probably came from the pack, but man, this is texturized as well. Oh, look how happy that Pikachu is. Oh my gosh, what a beautiful card. I love it, I love it. And another Professor's Oak. Oh my gosh, we are getting some hits. Gosh, really, really cool set. Like I said, great set to kind of get back into Pokemon. Great set if you have kids who are into Pokemon. Highly, highly recommend. We got Groudon, Cosmog, Yavelto, and in the back we got Lunala. All right, here we go. The second to last pack. Let's see if I could get something good. We're looking for that red lizard. That is the chase card. We got Lugia. Ho ho again. Here we go. Look at this. So we have a Clado. So this card must have been something special when it came to the game. So the Poke Power, once during your turn, before you attack, may, you may choose up to two cards from your hand and put them on the bottom of your deck in any order. If you do, draw cards until you have six cards in your hand. Wow. So this card must have been very, very important back in the day because 
still to this day it is very important to be able to draw cards uh, in the game it's essential to be able to find the cards you need and to help you win wow this card is also textured right it's really really cool and in the back we have another surfing pikachu i am running out of room Wow, we got three surfing Pikachus, and here is our last pack. Let's see if we could get some last pack magic going on. Here we go. We have Reshiram, Kyogre, Groudon. In the back, we have... Oh! We have so many professors research, but this is the full art professor's research wow again this is texturized man card looks amazing another great great pool wow so look at all these hits i don't know how many we have but we have quite a bit and this set has been really really fun uh i love all these pikachu cards i mean what's a 25th anniversary of Pokemon without Pikachu. Uh, unfortunately, we didn't get to see any of the uh, three cards that I, I was looking for. Um, if you didn't know, the three cards are Charizard, Venusaur, and Blastoise. These are the original uh, three big cards um, when Pokemon first came out. Uh, I have never gotten them when I was a kid. So I definitely want to be able to get them now uh, just to have that feeling that I missed out on because I didn't really get a lot of Pokemon cards growing up. So I'm going to be getting more of these products. Uh, I'm going to be opening more of these packs and hopefully I could complete the set. This set is awesome. So like I said, if you really enjoy Pokemon, if you have kids, if you want to get into Pokemon cards, collecting cards, these are the products you want to get the 25th anniversary celebration set um, thank you for watching and go ahead and subscribe to my youtube channel i will be making more of these videos as i get more of these celebration products it's been a while that i made some videos uh, i've been very busy but i will definitely be making more from this set so again thank you for watching and i will see you in the next one